With a high quality website and necessity for even the smallest businesses these days, the web hosting industry is booming. There's a great opportunity in the market to utilize reseller hosting to create a recurring revenue stream online. So don't worry if you think you're late to the party because today I'm going to be showing you what reseller hosting is and just how easy it is to set up your own web hosting business. This is Elliot with Verpex and let's get straight into it. Let me start off by explaining what reseller hosting is. And without complicating things, reseller hosting basically allows you to rent server space from larger hosting companies like Verpex, and then you can go and sell that server space on to small and medium sized businesses under your own brand name. This allows you to sell hosting services to your clients as if you were the hosting provider yourself. Now let me go over a few reasons why you might want to start your own web hosting business. Reason number one is that it's fairly easy to get started. With our reseller hosting packages here at Verpex, we do a lot of the heavy lifting when it comes to setting up your reseller hosting business with our reseller hosting onboarding support. Reason number two is that you require very little technical knowledge. So a lot of the processes for your reseller hosting package with Verpex are automated. For example, we offer daily backups on all of the websites on your reseller hosting plans to reduce the risk of any problems arising. Reason number three is it won't break the bank. Our reseller hosting packages are extremely affordable and you can start by just offering reseller hosting to 15 clients and then as you get more clients on board you can scale up your reseller hosting packages. So I'll leave a link in the description to all of the Verpex reseller hosting packages. And reason number four is it's a great additional stream of recurring revenue. If you already run a web design or a digital agency you can offer your current clients web hosting services and get them set up with little extra effort. So like I say, I'll leave a link in the description to all of our reseller hosting packages. Let's go over a few things to consider prior to starting your reseller hosting business. Firstly, you need to know your market. Web hosting is a very competitive industry, but there definitely is room to succeed if you go into the right market. So think about the type of customers that you want to serve. Are you wanting to create a web hosting business specifically for small businesses that you think are paying over the odds for web hosting? Or maybe you want to provide a more hands-on approach to a website setup that larger hosting providers don't offer. So think about the type of customer and the type of niche that you want to provide to for your web hosting services. A great way to stand out in the web hosting market is to offer web hosting to a specific niche. For example, you could center your web hosting business specifically around e-commerce owners or small restaurant owners, and this will make you the go-to web hosting company for these types of customers. Have a look at your competitors in this niche, see what prices they charge, see what type of support they offer to customers, and this will help you to gauge whether you can break into that market. Now let's finish off by going over the step-by-step -step process you need to take in order to start your web hosting business. Step one is to choose the right hosting partner. When deciding who to rent server space from, there are a few things that you'll want to consider. Firstly, the price of the reseller hosting package. This will help you to determine whether you can turn a profit with your web hosting business. You'll want the hosting provider to offer 24 seven around the clock support, which of course we do offer here at Verpex. What uptime guarantees are stated? You should be looking for at least 99.99% uptime guarantee, which once again, we offer here at Verpex. Is white label hosting offered? This means hosting will be completely anonymous and your customers won't know you're reselling, giving you full brand control. We allow custom domains on our reseller hosting name servers. And finally, where are your servers located? Look for regions closer to your customer base for faster speeds. Once again, we allow you to choose your server locations based on your needs. Step number two, put a client handling mechanism in place. Once you're set up with the ideal host and the right reseller hosting package, now you're going to need to find a way to manage all of your customers' orders and queries. Most resellers opt for an all-in-one management panel like WHMCS. The WHMCS dashboard will usually come as an add-on and can be integrated into the back end of your website. It centrally manages all of your billing and orders and comes with integrated support tools like incident ticketing and a knowledge base function. This kind of management tool is vital for smooth running of your business and it's super affordable. Step number three, bringing in clients. Of course, it helps if you have an already existing client base such as previous web design clients, but of course you can start building your client base by creating content related to your web hosting niche and sharing this on social media. 
you can also try out paid ads such as Google Ads to find your first web hosting clients. Check out our other video that we created on how to find your first WordPress web design client because a lot of those tactics can be applied to find your first web hosting client as well. Step number four, prepare for growth. Once you have your first 15 or so web hosting clients, you can think about upgrading your reseller hosting plan and taking on more clients to expand your business. You can also perhaps reinvest some of the profits to hire freelancers to deal with customer queries so that you can focus more on marketing. Now, of course, you're going to want to be doing a lot of the stuff yourself in the beginning, and it's not going to be easy to set up, but it's always best to start expanding your business by reinvesting the profits. So there you have it, your step-by-step -step guide to starting your very own reseller web hosting business. If you have found value in the video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more content surrounding starting a web hosting business. This has been Elliot with Verpix, and hopefully I'll see you in the next one.